In this chapter, we are going to learn about the navigation's commands in Selenium. So let us understand what is navigation command. So here you can see that we have loaded this particular website called code.in test, let code.in slash test. Now if I go to the button, here we have like go to home. So if I click on that, it's going to take me to the home page. Now if I want to go to the previous page, I can click on this particular button, right? So that will take me to the previous or else if I want to go to the next page or the like uh, this next button, right? So if I click on that, that will take me to the same page again. So forward and backward. And if I have to do the um, navigation or the reload, then I can click on this reload button. Or else if I have to move to another website, I can probably say like Amazon.in. So we can perform all those with the help of navigation command. Let us see how to do that. So first we'll go to our button page. Uh, let's go to the button. Where is the button? Okay, so we'll take this as our home page. So first of all, of course, we have to write the uh, Chrome driver, driver equal to new Chrome driver to launch the browser. And then I'm going to say driver.get and then I'm going to pass the URL, right? So this is also fine. We can do it in an another way as well. So here I can say like driver dot uh, navigate dot two. This is also fine. Okay, you can use any of this. Now, if I can use any of this, why we need to functions you might ask me okay technically if i go within the two function um, that is basically the navigation class and this is basically my um okay if i go to the navigate and here we can see remote navigation is the class name so let me write a reference here so this is basically my remote navigation class and if i go within the remote navigation class and here you can see that we have function called to that internally calls the get okay so technically both are same why we have is basically the accessibility nothing much here right for example i can say like i can create an object for this so driver dot uh, navigate and i can create the navigate object here and i can say like navigate dot two and then let's say that i'm going to um, click on this particular button right so let's go and inspect and I'm going to do the click action. So let me do the click and I'm going to paste it over here. Okay. Okay. Now, uh, once I click on this, I'll just try to print the title, print the URL. So for example, when I click on that button, we are expecting this to be let code dot in, right? So let's say that's a south, uh, expecting let code dot in okay so and then i will do some uh, driver dot get current url so get current url is the function to get the uh, current url okay so once i click on the url that will print me okay and here first one is basically it should contain the um, buttons url right so i will just copy paste over here and here i will say like uh, buttons okay expecting buttons why I'm writing expecting without doing a session uh, because we haven't learned the session yet. So I'm just doing with the sysout as of now, maybe in future, we'll future chapters, we'll change this as well. Okay. Very good. Now let's go and move to the next one. Okay. So I have clicked on the um, home button that is the okay, from the button page and I'm expecting this to be let go dot in, right? Now, if I go and click on this previous button, then again, that should return me the buttons URL, right? So let's see that one. So here I can say like navigate dot uh, back previous in the sense we have a function called back. And if I have to again move forward, then I can say like navigate dot uh, forward. Okay. So if I go back in the sense, uh, it will come to the buttons. So let me uh, copy this one. Okay. And then if I click on the forward again, we are expecting this to be uh, the home page, let go dot in page. Okay. And if you want to do the refresh, you can do like uh, navigate dot refresh. Okay. So these are the four functions we have here. Okay. If I refresh, of course, the expected is this only. So let's not print it. Now let's go and run this. The first one is buttons, the home page, then it's going to click on the back and that's it. We are pretty much done actually. So here you can see expecting buttons. We got the buttons expecting let go dot in. We expected and we got it. Then again, buttons, we got the buttons and again, home, the home, right? 
so this is how actually that, that was very quick so that is why you are not able to see if you want to see what you can do so you can just some do like a thread dot slip between these lines and you can check off your own i will not waste your time here you can check off your own okay so very simple concept we have like four functions driver dot uh, navigate and that is going to give us this interface as navigation and the implemented class is remote navigation and within that we have few functions like two which internally call the get function and we have the back forward or the refresh okay so we mostly we have four other than that uh, two is also like we have like a uh, what do we call that we have overloaded function so we can send this url uh, this is basically like a remote url i think a remote url in the sense it will be from your java some url i think okay anyways let's not worry about that if you know this this that is pretty much enough okay uh, for the navigations we mostly use the uh, driver.get only so we'll write that in our base class when we are going to make some utilities okay so for this video i'm skipping that <laughs>